This is the Roulette Master, and I cannot wait to share with you the incredible new 8th Street Holy Grail system. One of my subscribers, Basir, says this is way better than the original, and it will take the original down in a head-to-head -head matchup. So that's what we're going to do today. This is going to be a lot of fun, and I can't wait to see uh, how this turns out. So we're going to start with the original first, and we're going to put $10 on first and second, 12 and start the timer, and here we go. And uh, let's see what we get here. That's a four black. Okay, that's a $10 win, and um, now we're just going to rebet and spin. Uh, with this system, we're going to increase by one unit when we lose, and we're not going to reset until a certain amount of profit is made. And uh, there's a loss, so it's real easy. All you have to do is just increase by one unit each time that you lose, and uh, again, keep it the same until we reach a profit level, which I'm going to show you here in a little bit. That's a 23 red, and that's a win. So when you win, if you're not at that profit goal, you just rebet and spin again. We're at 20 each, 40 total with the original Holy Grail, which I know a lot of people really love. And uh, that's a two black. So I can't wait to see if Basir's uh, new 8th Street Holy Grail is that much better. He says it is, and I can't wait to see. Uh, let's go ahead and rebet and spin again. And uh, here we go. Okay, that's a uh, 15 black. All right, that's a win. So we stay right there. We're up 50. And uh, let's spin again. We're at 20 each, 40 total still. And uh, here we go. That's a 21 red. And that's a win. So um, we're up 70. Let's just rebet and spin. I'll let you know when we get to the profit goal here, the first one. And um, let's see what we get here. That's a 16 red. That's another win. And uh, already, with the original Holy Grail, we're up $90. All right, let's go ahead and spin again here. Here we go. That's another win, 22 black. Great start for the original Holy Grail. And uh, we're up $110, getting closer to that uh, profit goal. And um, when we get there, we're going to reset back to $10. But that's a loss right there on 26 black, so we increased by one unit. You can see we're up 70 right now. Let's uh, let's increase that. Now we're at 30 each, 60 total. And uh, Basir says that his new system, um, there's a lot of reasons why it's better, but he said the reset amount and um, everything uh, just all comes together for the perfect roulette system. So I can't wait to see how this turns out. We're up 100. Uh, we're not to that reset point yet, so we're going to stay at 30 each, 60 total. And here we go. That's a 34 red. And that's a loss. So we're going to increase again. Now we're at 40 each, 80 total with the original Holy Grail. And this is a fantastic roulette system as well. And um, I know a lot of you really like it. That's a 23 red. And um, that's a $40 win. We're up $80. We'll just rebet and spin. And um, I think a reason a lot of people like the Holy Grail is because the progression goes up slowly instead of doubling or tripling. And um, a lot of people like that. So um, we're up 120. Let's rebet and spin. We're at 40 each, 80 total now. Three minutes in out of 15 right now. And um, that's a 13 black. That's another win. Okay, so we just reached our profit goal of $150. Now we reset back to 10. Our next profit goal is going to be $300, an additional 150. So let's go ahead and spin at 10 each, 20 total. And here we go. That's a win with a 21 red. All right, we're up 170. Let's uh, spin again here. Only increasing after losses, keeping the same after wins until we reach 300 profit. Now an additional 150. So there's a loss. We'll check our balance. We're up 150 currently. We're going to increase to 20 each, 40 total here. And here we go. That's a win with the six black. All right. Okay, so we're up 170. We'll just rebet and spin again, trying to get to 300. Four minutes in now out of 15 minutes with the original Holy Grail, and that's a loss, 25 red. Okay, we're up 130, and um, let's increase. We're at 30 each, 60 total now after we increased. Just going up one unit with each loss, and that's a win with the one red there. So that's awesome. We're uh, up 160. Let's rebet and spin again at 30 each, 60 total. That's another win, 17 black. All right. Okay, we're up 190 now. 
Right, let's spin again here. That's a nine red. That's a win. So we're up 220. We're getting a little closer to our next profit goal of 300. Only $80 away, and we're five minutes in out of 15. That's a loss, though, 36 red. So we increase by one unit, just like we always do when we have a loss. Uh, now we're at 40 each 80 total, and then we'll check our balance after this one. That's a win, 14 red. So we'll stay right where we're at. We're up $200. So let's uh, rebet and spin. All right, here we go. Okay, it's a 25 red. That's a loss. So we'll increase just like we do with every loss, but just one unit at a time. And again, I think that's why a lot of people like this. The progression is slow. You're not doubling or tripling. There's another loss, 25 red. When you get back-to-back -back losses like this, it makes a big difference if you're only going up one unit instead of doubling or tripling. And um, with the $2,000 bankroll, which we have for this one, we can be patient until we start getting some wins consecutively. And that's a seven red. That's a $60 win. We're currently up 80. Let's stay right here at 60 each, 120 total, and see what we get next. That's a 10 black. Okay, that's a win. So now we're up 140. We'll stay right here at 60 each and spin again. Here we go. That's a loss, 35 black. Okay, so we're gonna increase by one unit. That drops us back to $20 profit temporarily, but that's okay because when you go up in the progression, even if it's one unit at a time, once you get on a streak, uh, you can come right back. And uh, we're just having some consecutive losses. But again, that's um, that's why it's so important to go up by one unit instead of doubling or tripling because it's um, much safer. And uh, we've had three losses in a row now. So you can only imagine if we were doubling or tripling uh, what would happen there. So we're just at 90 each now, 180 total. And we can be patient for a run because... We have the right amount of bankroll at $2,000. And there's a win at 90, so we'll stay right there. So temporarily, we're, we're negative, but we still have plenty of time left, and um, we can be patient and wait for a good run. And that's not a good thing right there, though. That's a zero, so we're going to uh, increase again. Now we're at 100 each, 200 total. And temporarily, we're minus 370, but we can come right back if we just get on a nice little run. But right now we haven't done that. That's another loss. Let's increase again. Okay, we're at 110 each, 220 total now. Almost eight minutes in out of 15. And uh, they finally got a win with a six black after, uh, looks like, th um, yeah, two consecutive losses, but uh, four out of five losses. So that's not very good. And um, let's go ahead and rebet and spin again. Actually, the more I look at, we've had one, two, three, four, yeah, five losses. That's correct. Um, but five losses will, you know, take you down, but you have to, uh, um, you know, have bankroll and patience to come back. And that's what I'm hoping we have here, uh, coming up. And that's a 110 win. We're just going to rebet and spend. And you can see if we get on a good run where we don't hit third 12 or zero for, you know, four or five spends, uh, you know, we can get it right back. So let's do that. And we're minus 240 currently, but we're making $110 per win right now. So let's see if we can get on a run. That's another win, one red. So things are turning around for us. Uh, we're minus 130 though still. We need to get a couple more wins here. And uh, here we go. Remember, we're trying to get to 300 profit, but I would recommend that if you get um, in a situation where you have a ton of losses and you get way down, um, then you, know, you might not have to get all the way back to the, your profit goal. You could probably go back to the original profit goal of 150. Uh, but let's see if we can do that at least. That's an eight black. Okay, that's a 110 win, and at least we're back in profit now. That's great. So let's stay right here and spin, and then we'll see where we end up. Okay, that's a win, five red. So let's see how much profit we have. Okay, we're up 200. You know what? I'm going to say right now we reset at 200, even though um, we're trying to get to 300. You don't want to be greedy when you've had a really bad run like that. We're up $200. We're only $100 away. So... Um, you know, that, it's smart to just reset at that point. 
And anytime you have a really bad run, don't uh, think you have to get all the way back to where you were before. You can build it back up. And you can see that was a really good choice for us because we would have lost that one and then we would have been down again. And um, we're still up a lot because we made a good smart choice there. And that's a 20 black. Okay, so we're up 200. Let's spin again and see if we can get some wins here. We're still trying to get to 300 profit and uh, that's a $20 win. We're up 220, but it's smarter to do it this way and get a few, uh, you know, wins, smaller wins to get us to that 300 than to try to get it all in one spin. Uh, okay, we're up 240. Let's uh, rebet and spin again. We're 10 and a half minutes in out of 15. There we go. And that's a loss, 35 black. So we're going to go up another unit. Oops, let me fix that. Okay, so we're going to 30 each 60 total. We're still up 200, so doing really well. And uh, here we go. That's a 29 black, and that's a loss. So we go up a unit, just like we do with any loss. And now we're at 40 each 80 total. We're 11 minutes in out of 15. That's a 24 black. Okay, and that's a win. So we're up 180 now. We'll stay at 40 each 80 total and see if we can get uh, back up to that $300 level. That's a 27 red, though. That's a loss. So it's a good thing we're only going up one unit at a time when we have losses uh, because we've had a lot of them today, but we're still up and doing great. And uh, here we go. We're 11 minutes, 22 seconds in. And that's a 27 red. Okay, that's a loss. So let's go ahead and increase. We're at 60 each, 120 total. Sorry if you hear my dog in the background. He's having a little fit of some kind. <laughs> And that's a 31 black. That's another loss. So let's go ahead and increase again. Now we're at 70 each, 140 total. And for those of you that don't know, I have a King Charles Cavalier. Uh, really good dog, but he's having a little fit right now, isn't he? And uh, we're minus 50. We're going to stay right here at 70 each, 140 total and spin. Okay, that's a 34 red. That's another loss. So we still have three minutes though left. Let's increase again. We're at 80 each, 160 total, and let's spin. Let's see what we get here. That's a 20 black. Okay, that's a win. And um, let's go ahead and rebet and spin again at 80 each, 160 total. And that's a 15 black. Okay, that's an $80 win. We're at minus 30. We'll stay right there at 80 each, 160 total. Let's be patient and let's try to get a good win. That's a three red. That's a good one. So we're back in profit, I believe. Yes, we're up 50. Let's uh, rebet and spin again at 80 each. We have two minutes left with the original Holy Grail. And then the, uh, the new one is coming up. And I think you're going to absolutely love it. That's a loss there, so we're going to increase again to 90 each, 180 total, and uh, we need to finish with some wins, but we got a couple minutes left here. Uh, let's see if we can get on a roll. That's an 18 red. Okay, we're minus 20, but it doesn't take long if you get on a streak. So let's get on that streak, and uh, let's, let's stay away from high numbers and zeros. And that's an 8 black. So we're up 70. Let's uh, rebet and spin again at 90 each, 180 total. A minute and a half left with the original Holy Grail. But that's a zero. That's not good for anybody. <laughs> but uh, that's okay. We're going to um, increase again. We're at 100 each, 200 total now. Okay, that's a 34 red. That's another loss. So that put us down again. Now we're minus 310. And um, we're going to have to increase again. But uh, even if we don't get back in profit with this, this is a great system. Um, you just have to um, be patient and have your bankroll because eventually you're going to go on a nice run. It just happens to be that we're having a downturn right here before our 15 minutes is up. Uh, we're at 120 each, 240 total, 45 seconds left. And um, that's another loss, 28 black. Just remember, we haven't lost our bankroll. Uh, we can still come back from this, um, but uh, you know it's going to take patience and bankroll, as it always does when uh, you have a really bad run. 
And there's a win with 18 red. Okay, we're minus 640. We'll rebet and spin at 130 each. And um, here we go. But I don't think we're going to have enough time for this one to come back all the way. And um, we're going to find out here shortly. We're at minus 510. Let's rebet and spin again here. And that's another loss. 27 red, and time just expired. So we ended up minus $770 with the Holy Grail. Now, it could definitely have come back at, like it has many, many times. But at the 15-minute mark, we had a bad run there. And uh, the Holy Grail ended up down $770 after 15 minutes. But uh, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. And uh, now it is time for Basir's new uh, system that he says is so much better than the original Holy Grail. I'm going to show you why. Let's just jump right into it and get started. And uh, let's see if we can make some money. Here we go. All right, the time is finally here for Basir's new 8th Street Holy Grail system. He said it's incredibly better than the original. And uh, let's go ahead and place the bets. And here we go. So we're going to have some $5 streets here. And he picks these based on the, where the numbers are in the roulette wheel. So um, you can see we have five right there. And um, now we're going to have three from the 25 to 33. And uh, that's a $40 total bet, which is a little different than the original Holy Grail. Let's go ahead and spin. I'm going to show you the differences. The reset point's going to be different and um, some other things too. So that's a 31 black to start. And we get $20 with each win. So you can see we're up 20. Uh, we're just going to rebet and spin until we have a loss. And then I'll show you what to do next. That's a 36 uh, red there, and that's a loss. So we're going to increase those by one unit um, and spin. And let's see what we get here. And then I'll show you what else we need to, to look at. And uh, that's a 10 black. Okay. So with this system, if we're not in $50 profit, instead of 150 like the original, if we're not in $50 profit, we stay the same. So we're going to stay at $80 here. And let's see what we get. That's a 34 red. And that's a loss. So we're going to increase everything by a unit again. We're currently minus 60. So let's go ahead and do that. We're going to add $5, which is what we started with, to each one of these streets. Okay, now we're at 120 total. And um, the uh, reset point is much easier to achieve with this one, as you're going to see as we go through here. That's a 26 black. And that's a $60 win. We're back to even. We're just going to rebet and spin until we get to $50 profit, which again is very easy to achieve with the, uh, the changes that Basir has made to the Holy Grail. And um, I think we just did it. So we just already achieved our first goal of 50. Now we're trying to get to $100 profit. So we reset back to the original $40. And the reason it's $40 is because we have uh, we have eight uh, streets at five dollars each so let's go ahead and spin again here and again Basir picks these streets um, because of where they're at on the roulette wheel so he really likes these numbers and um, there's another win so we are already up eighty dollars and uh, let's spin again we'll see how this does over the full 15 minutes but he says that this system is so good that you'll you won't need any other systems after this one so I don't know we'll see um, we're up a hundred now let's uh, rebet and spin and here we go. That's a 35 black, and that's a loss. And uh, let's see where we're at. We're up 60. And um, let's go ahead and um, increase those by one unit. So we'll go from 40 to 80, basically. Here we go. That's a one red. I believe that's a win. Okay, so now we reached our next profit goal of 100. Now we, we make sure we, we're at $10. I'm sorry, not at $10 like the original. We're back at the original 40. So let's do that. And again, that's because we have eight $5 streets. Um, so now we're trying to reach 150 profit. And you can see these profit goals are much easier to attain than the original Holy Grail. And um, the bet's a little bit bigger. So um, we're up 120 now, just trying to get to 150. And uh, let's see if we can reach that next goal. And that's a 15 black. That's another win. So we're up 140. Let's spin again. Another win. We'll have another goal. 
achieved and uh, that's awesome really easy to achieve these goals i like that that's a 24 black but we lost so we're going to uh increase by one unit and again we're trying to get to 150 profit we're still at 100 now after that loss that's a 22 black and that's another loss so we're going to go up by one unit again so we'll add five to each of these the first time that um that I, that I increased by one unit. I just hit the double button because it's the same thing. But you can only do that one time and then you need to add them in um, one at a time, which doesn't take long at all. That's a 19 red. That's another loss. Okay, so we're minus 100 after those back-to-back -back losses, but that's okay. Uh, Basir says you'll come right back. Let's see if it happens. So we're uh, adding five to all these again. Okay, we're at 160 total bet now, four and a half minutes in out of 15. That's another loss though, 36 red. So let's increase again. And we have plenty of time to come back. And uh, Basir says we'll, we will come back. Just hang in there with bankroll and patience. And uh, you will come back and make a lot of money like he's doing. So let's see if that happens. Uh, that's a 10 black. I think we got a win there finally. That was a little bit of a win drought, um, but let's go ahead and rebet mm -hmm. and spin. Again, we're trying to get to 150 profit, so we're gonna stay right here until that happens. And that's a 17 black. That's another loss though. So we're minus 360, but this is a $2,000 bankroll. Remember, you can also do this with a $400 bankroll and dollar units, but let's add those fives in. And, um, cause I wanna give everybody options depending on you know how much money you have to play with and uh, that's important so now we're at 240 total five and a half minutes in out of 15 and here we go that's an eight black let's go on a run there's a nice 120 win uh, let's rebet and spin again and let's get some wins here come on seven red i think that's another win Fantastic. Uh, we're minus 120, another one of those, and uh, we'll be out of the hole, and then we can start making some profit again. That's a 15 black. I think we got that one right on the last one. That's great. So now let's see if we can get ahead again and uh, make some money. Here we go. Six minutes in now out of 15. That's a 10 black. And that's a win. We're up 120 now, trying to get to 150 profit. We're almost there. We just need one more. That's a 31 black, and that's a win. So we did reach our 150 profit goal and our two, uh, 200 profit goal and almost our 250 profit goal. So our next goal is, um, and let's go back to the original amount. We're going back to our original 40, which is eight uh, streets. Okay, and remember, we're up 240. All we have to do now is get to 250 to reset. So um, we're at the base level anyway. So let's see if we get that win real quick here. That's a 32 red. Okay, and we did. So we're that's another profit goal made. Now we're trying to get to 300. So Basir says these uh, profit goals are very easy to attain, and I'm definitely seeing that. Our next one is $300 profit, and we're 7 minutes, 10 seconds in out of 15. That's an 8 black. And uh, we're up 280, another win, and we've already achieved another profit goal. So by increasing the bet a little bit and uh, by having a, a smaller profit goal, um, we're achieving these goals much easier. And you can see we just did it again. We're up 300. So now our next profit goal is 350. And let's go ahead and spin and uh, let's get to 350. Here we go. That's a zero, that's a loss. So we're gonna increase by one unit. And again, on the first one, you can just hit the double, but then after that, you need to add them in individually. And uh, here we go. That's a 24 black, and I believe that's another loss, it is. So let's go ahead and uh, now we have to add in the fives, but that's no big deal. Let's do that. All right, here we go. Okay, we added five to each. Now we're at 120 total, eight minutes and 10 seconds in out of 15 with the eight street Holy Grail system by Basir. And there's another loss. So uh, we are going to increase again. 
And just so you guys know, Basir said that he does not play um, on on American Roulette. But um, since the original Holy Grail was sent in on American, um, I did them both on American today. But just realize that we wouldn't have lost on any double zeros if we were playing the way he's playing. But um, I still think it'll do really well. Let's go ahead and see what we get here. That's an 18 red. That's a loss, though. Let's increase again. All right, here we go. Okay, now we're at 25 on all those. $200 total bet. Still plenty of time to uh, come back. Basir says just be patient and use your bankroll to your advantage. And that's a $100 win. Let's rebet and spend. And let's get back. Let's get to that 350 profit goal. That's a 21 red. And I think that's another loss, and it is. So we're minus 200 now. We'll increase again. But again, you can come back very easily with this system. So let's do it. Uh, this is a 240 total bet. That's a 28 black. I think that's a win. There we go. Finally got a win. Let's uh, rebet and spin. Let's see if we can get some uh, consecutive wins here. That would be nice. That's a 30 red. I think that's another win. And it is. We're up 40 now. Uh, let's spin again. Here we go. That's a 33 black. I think we just got it on that one. Yep. Up 160 now. So you can see how quickly you can come back from being down a lot with uh, with this modification of the original Holy Grail. This is the uh, 8th Street Holy Grail by Basir. And there's another one that, just so you guys know, Basir would not have lost because he doesn't play with double zero. But again, the original Holy Grail was American, so I did them both American today. And I know a lot of you uh, use uh, zero and double zero. So let's go ahead and add those back in again. Let me fix this. But when you test it, you can test it however you're going to play it. And uh, make sure you let everyone know in the comments. We're, up, we're at 280 total bet now. 10 minutes and 50 seconds in. That's a win on a 5 red. Okay, we're up 60. Let's rebet and spin. Let's get a few consecutive wins here. That's a 12 red. That's another win. We'll take it. We're up 200. All right, let's spin again. If we get a win here, that's close enough to 350. And let's reset. But that's a 23 red, and that is a loss. So we need to increase again. That puts us minus 80. But again, very easy to come back with this system. Uh, and the, the goals are very achievable and easy to achieve with just a few wins, which is nice. And we're 11 and a half minutes in out of 15. That's a win with a 3 red. That's what we needed to get us back in profit. And now we're up 80. Let's uh, rebet and spin here. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Another one that Basir would not have lost, <laughs> just so you guys know. And uh, of course, of course, uh, we hit the double zero a bunch of times. But you know what? A lot of you play with double zero, so hopefully that gives you guys some uh, insight into, uh, you know, what um, what it'd be like playing with the American wheel like we're doing. That's a 24 black, and that is another loss. That is rough. Okay. We're minus 600. Let's uh, increase again. But again, we can come back from this even though we're down a lot. We have plenty of time left. We're 12 minutes in out of 15. Okay, that's a 9 red. That's a win. Okay, let's uh, rebet and spin. As Basir says, he's making a lot of money doing this one, playing online. And... Uh, on a European table, and uh, that's a 25 red. That's another win. You can see we were down a ton, but um, another win, we'll be back in profit again. And that's a 34 red, though. That's a loss. So we need to increase again. And But it's important to have that $2,000 bankroll, or you can use 400 and use dollar units. That works, too. Uh, we have 440 total bet now, and we have a couple minutes left. That's a 17 black, though. That's a loss. Okay, so took a little bit of a downturn here.
Okay, 480 total. That's a six black. Okay, that's a 240 win. Let's uh, rebet and spin. Come on, it's time to get on a roll. That's another win, six black. Okay, we're minus 560 though. We need to get some consecutive wins here. Here we go. That's not it, that's a 22 black, that's a loss. So we need to increase again. And let's do that. Okay, we're at 520 total bet now. That's a win, 33 black. Okay, let's get some consecutive wins here. And let's see what we get. That's a 16 red, and that's a loss. Okay, that's not good. Let's increase again. But just so you guys know, if you were if we were playing this on the European table, we would not be down this much. I think we've had probably four double zeros in this session. <laughs> Five. Oh my goodness. Okay, Basir's gonna not be happy with me after this one. <laughs> so you know what I'm gonna do. Um, we're gonna play a little bit longer since he uh, says he doesn't use the double zero and we hit like five or six of them let's play a little bit longer and uh, let's see how this does when we don't hit double zeros and that's a 17 black okay and we did that took our bankroll as well so um, that uh, <laughs> that didn't work out that well there with all those double zeros um, so I tell you what, let's go ahead and um, let's play a little bit longer. Let's go ahead and uh, reset and we'll switch to European and uh, and uh, let's give it a little bit of a, of a shot without, uh, without the double zero. So here we go, let's give that a shot. Okay, I'm back. Let's play some spins on the European table like Basir plays. Let's go ahead and place the bets. And here we go. Okay, again, that's a $40 bet, and uh, we're going to reset after each $50 win. That's a 12 red. Okay, that's a win. We're up 20. Let's rebet and spin. That's a 14 red. Okay, that's a $20 win. We're up 40. All right, let's spin again here. That's a 30 red. Okay, so we're up 60. So that resets us back to 40 if we're not already there, but we're at, we're still at base level, so there's nothing to reset back to. That's a 25 red. Okay, that's a win. We're up 80, trying to get to 100 profit here. That's 11 black. Okay, that's 100 profit, so we reset if we're not already at 40, but we are at 40, so we just stay right here. And uh, this just shows you, obviously, this is a good system, but it can fail just like any other system if you have really bad luck. And um, once we're already going toward our 150 profit goal, and um, obviously it does help you to not have a double zero on the wheel. And um, But some people don't have that option, so that's something that's important. We're going to uh, increase by one unit since we lost, trying to get to 150. And um, you just have to play what's available to you. Uh, obviously, if you play online, you can you can play European, um, like Basir is doing. And um, and truthfully, we probably wouldn't have lost our bankroll if um, with the the first time we tried this. Um, and we're not to our next goal yet, so we'll stay right here. Um, if because I think we hit almost five, might have, it was four or five double zeros, <laughs> which is pretty crazy. And uh, but it can happen. And um, we're up 160 now. That's a new profit goal. We go back to 40. Our next profit goal will be 200. So I uh, just wanted to give uh, Basir a uh, a good shake <laughs> here and uh, do it the way that he said to do it with a European table. So we're gonna stay right here. I'm sorry, we lost that one. We're gonna increase. 
So now we're going to go to uh, 10 each instead of 5 each. Going up one unit with each loss. Resetting with each $50 of profit. And uh, we're up 160. We'll stay right there until we get to 200. And uh, you can see that this, this can be a really good roulette system like uh, Basir said. And because uh, we're already up 200, another profit goal made. Um, we go back to 40. We reset with each $50. And um, here we go. That's the 16 red. That's a loss. So we'll increase by one unit, trying to get to 250 now. And on the first one, you can hit the double button, even though you're increasing by one unit. You're not. Uh, it's not a doubling strategy. That's an 18 red. That's another loss. So we increase by one unit on each. Okay, now we're at 120. That's a 33 black. And that's a win. We're up 140 trying to get to 250. That's a 10 black. Okay, that's a $60 win. We're up 200. Let's try to get to 250 profit. Another $50 in profit. That's a 29 black. Okay, another win. We just made another profit goal. Now we're shooting for 300 and we reset back to 40. So I'm sure this is more like what Basir has been used to, but, um, but again, any bad things can happen at any time. Uh, you have to be prepared for them, and um, um, obviously we would not have uh, done as poorly with uh, with the uh, double zero not on the board. But you know, I wanted to be it to be uh, even with the original Holy Grail, which um, you know is a system that originally was played um, in uh, on American tables, and uh, we're already up three hundred. So obviously, you can see this system can work really well for you. Um, and I wanted to, you know, play a little bit for Basir with the European table like he's doing. Um, obviously did a lot better without those four or five double zeros, which is very unlucky, but can happen. Um, but let me know what you guys think down in the comments about both these systems. And, and you know, if one's better than the other in your opinion and uh, what, you know, what good things or bad things you like about each uh, or dislike about each. And um, that would be awesome. Remember to send your systems in to roulettemaster.c at gmail.com. That's roulettemaster.c at gmail.com. I pick a new one every single day of the week at 7 a.m. Central Time. Uh, we test them out, and then it's your guys' turn to uh, test them out and let everyone know and uh, you know what you guys think in the uh, comments. And uh, that really helps everyone in the community when they decide if they're going to take a system to the casino. If you guys share your results and uh, what you think about these systems in the comments, so keep helping each other out. I love seeing your systems every day. I think it's fantastic. And uh, keep it up. We'll keep growing this great community. If you uh, are liking the videos, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. This is the Roulette Master, and have a great day, everybody.